Right, there you go. Rucksack's on. Tease me, Nad. Not too sure uh, how good an idea two pints was, to be honest. We'll find out. Oh, yeah. The Bali Village Centre. Get out of here. Past the two Ogden Resis. We'll find somewhere to uh, stick a couple of tents. I'll see you along the way. Oh, man, man, man. Oh, man. <laughs> That's a sure enough. Come in, I'm coming. It's like that. Right, well, I'm not too sure if you've, uh, if I've said or not, but I'm out with Phil. Phil's here with me. Oh, six Phil. I'm sure you'll recognise him. Wander around here. Here somewhere, back there, I don't know. Is he? You'll see him later on. <laughs> oh. Anyway, come on. What time are we on now? Eight o'clock. We need to uh, find a home for these tents. Oh. We need to sack these hills off, Phil. We need to find mountain climbing that doesn't involve climbing any mountains. Well, there you go. That's the uh, dam for the upper Hogden Rice. Looks like there should be uh, plenty of water in there. That's the path up. Happy days. Let's get up there. Oh. Man, man, man. Oh, we've got water, Phil. All right, that's where we're heading. Straight up there. Straight to the top. We're now out onto the uh, open moorland. Follow the uh, other cliff up. See what we can find. Hopefully. Nice flat level grassy pitches. Fingers crossed.
Right, well there you go, that's us all set up. I'll keep post star. I'll take you around in a second. Just losing the line now. I think we just got uh, pitched up just in time. Yeah, I'll give you a quick wander around. Uh, I think Phil's kindly uh, donated a beer. It's time for a sit down, chill out, have a bit of a crack, have a bit of a chat, and then we'll hit the sack. And then up, early doors, we'll be faced by wonderful sunsets. Sunsets, sunrises even, you stupid pillock. And we'll, uh, fingers crossed, we'll, uh, we'll get some shots. But looking at these uh, grey clouds at the minute, I'm not quite sure that's going to happen. You never know. I'll show you around. There we go, folks. There we go. That's the uh, back out on the Alpkit Pole Star. Quite sure how much of that you can see to be honest, we're getting a bit uh, losing the light now. But yeah, two poles, a couple of guy ropes, a few pegs, easy peasy. Inside, usual, Ugh. usual pillow, thermal X light, help kit 400, piping 400. Slippers, fleecy blanket, jumper, jobs are good in. There you go, nothing too exciting. Well, there's some we've got Phil working about in the gloom. Lanshan, one, two, whatever it is. One. one. Beer. Beer, well done, mate. Let's do it. There we go, and that's where we are. Because it's belting. Hmm. Why not? Take yourself out of the hmm. out of the norm. Oh, I'm looking forward to it in Scotland next week. Went to try and book the. Uh, we got to, supposed to go to Isle of. Cheers, Phil. <laughs> Not truly dark now. Well, and truly dark. No stars though. Big, thick, grey clouds. Boring sky. Doesn't bode well for any uh, sunrise in the morning. Might just be a bit of a lion. This is beer off, and uh, we'll chit chat, and then we'll uh, hit the sack. I'll see you back in there. See you shortly. Right, that's us all done. All tucked up. Doesn't waste spending the evening. A couple of hours chit chatting away with Phil there. A couple of beers. Very nice, very nice. And then uh, finish off. Bit of a uh, bit of astrophotography, so nothing too dramatic. There was uh, lots of clouds, handful of stars maybe, but yeah, we'll see what we get. Anything exciting? As usual, stick it on. I'll we'll stick it on. But anyway, haven't really had a chance to uh, show you around the tent properly. Felt a bit uh, guilty after the last one. I think uh, I'd give the impression I didn't like the tent. I think. What I didn't uh, was one. What I was trying to say was I wasn't convinced by uh, trekking poles. Being that I don't use trekking poles, it seemed a bit odd. Just taking a pair of trekking poles rather than uh, tent poles. But uh, the tent itself is actually all right. Um, like I said, once you're on properly in the morning. Anyway, I think it's time for uh, a bit of chill out. Which, uh, Something on the phone, I think, and then hopefully, fingers crossed, up early doors. 
some awesome sunrise and a few shots there pitch up and then uh, we're off to work hopefully and we'll see you in the morning night and night Morning everybody. Morning. Oh, Boy, quite easy now sleep. Quarter to five now. Quarter to five. I'll get up and uh, see what this uh, sky is looking like. Yeah, I've woke up and had a drop of a drip of something on my face, and I've got the uh, the other tent. He's all stuck to the. Uh, outside to the fly sheet just make it all wet so not happy about that <sighs> big big fail so mm. not too impressed mm. anyway I'm still here I'm still here haven't got washed away right come on Let's uh, make a move. Let's see what this guy is doing. We're about quarter to five at a minute. So. Sunrise is about half an hour away. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Mm. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Absolutely big, thick, grey cloud. Morning, Phil. Morning. <laughs> 5 a.m. Bright and breezy. Morning, 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 everybody. Hmm. That's uh, not too happy there, to be honest, this morning. My tent, my uh, fire sheet stuck to the inner. It's all a bit. Uh, it's a little bit wet inside. Hmm. Not good. Not good. So yeah. Yeah. Anyway. You live and learn. You live and learn. That's uh, grey, claggy. And all. It's a bit of blue sky coming up behind you. Ten past five. It's time to get uh, get a coffee on. And. Uh, Maybe see if we can get a four to a two. But, uh, I'm not holding my breath. It's Phil wandering around. Checking the old time lapse, I think. Oh, but yeah. Coffee time. Hmm, not right that happening, other than midges. Midgey, midgey, midgey. Well, oh, oh, as long as you've got the footprint, you put the footprint down first. The poles then attach the... Poles attach the fly sheet. Yeah. 
then you hang the flies you want top and then pin the So there you go, there's a the tent, like I was saying. The fly sheet is all wet. And then stuck to the inner. That's just far too saggy. It needs. It needs pinning out. It needs another peg, pegging point on that side there to keep it off. Not the same on that side. So yeah, so we're all wet. And the wet is then obviously transferred through onto the inner. The inner into the tent. Warm wet tent. Hmm. Where we were, patch of grass for me, patch of grass for Phil. Well, there you go, that's it, all done. Packed up, two patches of bare grass. All we're gonna do now is uh, ship ass and get ourselves back to the car, get ourselves into work. Thanks for watching, see you all next time. Bye bye bye.